you're watching News 54. The political muscles continue ravaging the country and Kenyans are eagerly waiting to see what will happen to Kimi Lulai MP Didmus Baraza who allegedly killed a man during the last elections. Things are getting messy for him after DCI Kenya disclosed this information. According to DCI Kenya, the forensic evidence shows the bullet fired came from the gun that Didmus Baraza has. More information revealed that the magazine recovered too was related. This followed a report issued by the ballistic experts after the investigating team forwarded Barris's Glock pistol, a cartridge retrieved from the scene and bullet fragments to the ballistic lab for forensic analysis. The report noted that the recovered cartridge was fired by the Glock pistol issued to Honorable Barrisser. Further, a post-mortem report by the government pathologist opined that the cause of death was severe head injury occasioned by a gunshot wound. During the autopsy, bullet fragments were also retrieved from the scene.